of course, right from the very first day. And I'm going to teach him that okay. he's going to be responsible oh, for, your kid, for things it's, it's that he does. Do as I say, that, not as I do. And huh? things that, right, I mean, things, I'm going to tell him that he's going to be responsible for everything that he does and everything he does not do. Well, remember, I just told you it doesn't matter he, what you tell him. It's what he sees you doing. You need to be making good choices in your life. That's why when I was involved in the Crystal Methodist Church down there in F in South Carolina, my got, all got, three of my sons right, would see I, me do good works. Feeling, they would always see me handing gonna, out, you know, I, pants and clothing to, to the homeless people to. of a, a charity called uh, Holy Shirts and Pants. Welcome back to Scammer Jammer. My name is Iron here, and this is part five of our little mini series with this three and a half hour call when it came to an Amazon scammer. Now, if you have just started watching this, well, go back and check out the first few parts. The playlist is in the description below, so you can check that out. See how disgusting and vile this scammer actually is in episode one and two, and then watch what happens as we start breaking him and had a little fun doing that while we broke them. So this is the next part of the call. And well, it got pretty interesting. And this is where I actually did the one chip challenge. So it was pretty interesting to see, but here you go and enjoy. Hello, this is an automated call from Amazon. We have identified some suspicious activity on your Amazon account. So we have strongly restricted doing any financial activity on your Amazon account until and unless this concern will fixed. Please press one to talk to Amazon customer support. Thank you. How old is your son? Eight months. When he gets older and he could say, oh, my dad is a professor at a college. My dad he is a person who gets medical supplies at the hospital. Or my dad is a person who installs light fixtures in an office building. Those are all going to be things that he could be proud of his dad for, right? Right. Is he going to be proud of what you're doing now in your life? Well, if I move up the ladder, I work here as a manager. I'm one of the managers here and at Amazon, and I'm doing the overflow tonight. But I can't say what he's going to think of my job when he grows up and see me doing what I do now. But when he grows up and gets a little bit of sense of understanding around uh, uh, things around him, I think I'll not be doing the same thing. I'll be doing something better and bigger, maybe. Well, that's what I was asking you. What did you want to be when you grow up? Well, I want to be a... I'd say I would like to be a... I, I thought about it, and I wanted to be a management guy, like one of those guys in the upper management, get my master's, and then be one of those big guys five seven years down the line okay a master's degree in what business administration okay well do you think so for example when when you take all these degrees do, do you have do you have a do you have an associate's degree do you have a bachelor's degree I do, yeah. 
You have a, what do you have, an associate's degree? Correct. Uh? Yes, that's right. I do have, have an associate's an degree. A, you have an associate's degree? But you have a bachelor's right. degree. I do have an associate degree. What is your associate's degree in? That's in business administration. Okay. So did you have to take courses like economics, uh, you know, business and organizational Finance. management, uh, algebra? Finance. Uh, what kind of courses did you have to take Finance. to get that degree? Finance. I'm an economist. Oh, okay. Well, then why are you doing this? Because I'm just preparing for my master's. Uh-huh. So I can well, get a why, better if, job. If you're taking all these business courses, then why are you doing this? This is not a bad job. That's not what the internet said. About this Amazon job? Y y yes, apparently, you know, anyone with a college degree would never be doing this. Now, a lot of people with college degree is doing this. I know them. And they're uh, working with us in the, same organ in the same organization. Amazon is the biggest company in the world, right? Biggest retail, retail and e-commerce. Yes. Well, I just wanted to know, so because you said that you have a child... And when you take it from me, the reason I raised three upstanding fine young men, I've got Ruprecht, and he just graduated clown school, and I've got George, he helps me all the time, and I've got my youngest son, Tybalt. Now, the, take it from me, the way that you raise good upstanding people is by being a good, honest, upstanding person yourself. See, it doesn't matter what you say to the child. It's what the child sees you doing in life. So if you, I could tell in your voice that you, you may tell me that what you're doing is okay, but I can hear in your voice that you have a deep, sense of embarrassment and guilt and shame how are you going to be a good influence for your child well <clears throat> you asked me that question three years from now because i have uh, my own plans that i'm working on and in three years i'll have to to be where i want to be like one of those guys with my masters and all, and I won't be doing this from three years three years from now. Ah, oh, okay. Well, what's your plan? I I wanna I wanna be an economist. Oh, okay. And then you'll understand. Uh, you'll understand a lot better about the accepting responsibility for your actions. 
Yeah, that's right. Are you going to teach your child how important it is to accept responsibility for their actions? Of course, right from the very first day. I'm going to teach him that okay. he's going to be responsible oh, for things it's, that it's he does. Do as and I things things say, not as I do. Huh? Things right. I mean, things... I'm going to tell him that he's going to be responsible for everything that he does and everything he does not do. Well, remember, I just told you it doesn't matter what you tell him. It's what he sees you doing. You need to be making good choices in your life. That's why when I was involved in the Crystal Methodist Church down there in I, uh, F in South Carolina, my... And all again, three of my sons right, would see me I, do I good works. Feeling, they would always see me handing out, you know, I, pants and clothing to, to the homeless people of a, a charity called uh, Holy Shirts and Pants. And then they would always see me, uh, you know, handing out food to the less fortunate. Uh, and they see me doing good things and helping my community. It doesn't matter what I told them. Did do you do good things to help people? I do, yeah. And I'm going to lead by example because I know he's going to Oh, that's amazing to hear. Me, what kind so. of good things do you do? What what how many people do you help? What do you do to help yourself and your community? Whatever I can do, like when I see people who need food, then I give them food, I give them clothes, I give them medications, whatever help I can afford, I do that. Whatever charity I can afford, I do that. If I could give somebody like a disabled person, if she needs my help, he needs my help, I just go there and help them. Maybe I see a disabled Oh, so you're out there like Mother the Teresa, just I, handing out all your food and all the clothes and all your belongings to people? Now, George, don't park over them, there. Whatever, I told you to I've, park closer. Bams, you're out there like Mother Teresa Bams, trying to help there away. as we pay, giving away all your stuff? Not all of them. George is saying something. Hold on. I'll hold the phone back up to him so you can talk to him. Hold on. There you go. Uh, uh, Grams, I was just saying that we, we were parked three no, spots I just, away. No, I, I, I don't need to talk to Azwipe right now. Oh, well, we're in the Walmart parking yeah, lot. Do you want to tell me what I'm supposed to be doing here, Azwipe? He knows what he needs to do. Yeah, Grams, we gotta, we gotta, get, we gotta Teresa, get more gift cards. Uh, oh, that's right. Get the Google validation card. Yeah. Google Play cards. Go get that hover round over there. I don't like the one, this one. I want the other hover round with the bigger seat. All right, hold on, hold on, Grams. Give me a second. All right, Grams, he, 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 is this one the good one for yeah. you right here? Yes, this should be just fine. All right. Here you go, hon. All right, now I'm going to go and get this, um, what did he say? It was uh, the uh, validation card. Will you go get me some Japan's, and would you Google. see if my butthole corks are ready? Google. Google. Yeah, Graham, don't Google, worry. Google right. Play cards, Dorothy. They're called yeah, Google Play Gra cards. Grams, Grams, here, here. This is what we need right here. The pa the piece of paper. See how it says Google Play cards for verification. It says two Car for two hundred dollars. No, no, don't don't say verification. Just say Google Play cards. Well, I'm old, but I'm not that old. I remember exactly what Ozweepay told me. I'm gonna ask the. Uh, 
the girl that's standing over there to take me over to the... All right, Grams, hey, Grams, I'll be right hey, back, okay, Walmart, Grams? Walmart, did you take me to Google verification cards? I gotta get to Google verification it's cards. Not, Google verification it's not, cards, It's not please. Google verification cards. It's not Google verification, Dorothy. It's Google Play cards. Hello, sweet boy. Are you saying something? I didn't have the phone up to my ear. I said Google Play cards. Just say Google Play cards. Ask them where the gift cards are at, and then I'll tell you which card you need The girl's coming get. over here right they now. Don't need anybody's Can you wear the Google verification cards? Google Play cards. As we please tell me to tell you the Google verification play cards. Where are the Google verification play cards? Just say Google Play cards, Dorothy, not Google verification cards. Well, you know, I know that that girl can hear me, and she's just standing there. And she's just looking at me, and maybe okay, I'm too far on. away, Dorothy, but I'm listen, waving and waving and waving listen, towards her, and listen, I, I know Dorothy, she's looking right at Dorothy, me. Dorothy, and, Dorothy, you know, I don't me. care if she's Dorothy. talking to someone else. She should come over and help me. I'm okay. an old woman. Dorothy, Dorothy, can you hear me? Dorothy. Now, what, you know what? Maybe you could describe what this card looks like to me, and then I'll know. I tell you what. I tell you what. Can you hear me? All right, so I'm, I'm over here in the birthday card section, and here's the one that I was going to get for George, but don't tell me to buy it for him. It says, uh, it says, you're one in a melon. Isn't that funny? Uh, now, I don't no, see good. any of these birthday no, cards that say Dorothy. Google on them. All right. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Now, repeat after me. The card says Google Play Card. That's all. Google Play Card. Say that after me. Well, I see one that says you're one in a melon. I'm going to keep that uh, birthday card for George. And then I see one that says, congratulations, no. it's a okay. boy. Dor Dorothy. And then um, I okay, see one that says right. that Dor um, you're over the hill. You and that's me, like Can another birthday for card for someone who's old. And then I see a graduate. Oh, this one might be good for you. How about I send you this one? It says, congratulations, you graduated. When when you get your master's degree, do you want me to send you this congratulations card? Yeah, sure. I would love you to send that to me once when I graduate. Okay. That's not a problem. Okay. I'm I'm no, gonna okay. have to write down your name and no, your address so I can mail it okay. to you. I, so I'll I've got you, the one that says you're one in a I'll million. Give that to you, but uh, don't don't tell George that I'm gonna I, put I, that for his I, birthday. I, I, and then I'm gonna keep I, this one that says congratulations, you did it. That's gonna be for you. But yeah, I don't Rams. see any cards that say Google on them. Rams, I'm glad I found you. Look what look what they got right here. They got the the one chip challenge. Do you want me to get you some? Well, I think that's what's causing me can my diarrhea and the delicious. So I'm gonna, you know what? We can do a little bit of an experiment. Uh, well, I'll eat the one chip and can then I I'll eat the another one and see if it gives me the diarrhea. But maybe you should have one and see if it gives you the diarrhea. All uh, right. Yeah, yeah. I was going to get myself one. I wanted to try one of these things. Uh, can I can I talk to you? All right. Well, make sure you go. Don't not, don't open it in the store while we're in the aisle. You got to go and pay for it. Yeah, no, of course, Grams. That's what I was going to do. I just wanted to see if you wanted some, too. Uh, Dorothy, well, can you I, know can that I the security here at Walmart is so tight that even if you're walking around with a package, they'd be eyeballing you and eyeballing you. And even if you, you know, you pay for it when you get to the register, you still don't like that. Now, last time I got kicked out, oh, I don't want to go through any of that again. Now, uh, let's go pay can for I this thing. Hold on.
and you wheel me over, I'll, I'll pay for it for you. It'll be my... Uh, I know your birthday's coming up. I'm going to get you this for your birthday. Hey, wheel Dor me over to the Dor register. Dorothy, uh, right, can yeah. I talk... Can you, can you look for that Google Play card? Well, I told you, there's... Um, there's don't, don't tell George. He can't hear me right now. There's your one in a melon, and then I see one that says, you're over the hill... Um, and then I see a birthday card that there's another one that just says happy birthday on it, but I don't see one that says Google. Okay, the card is called Google Play Card. Let's see. I see we. I see the the sign that says we have cards for all occasions, birthdays. Graduations, sympathy, Bams. Bams. hospital. No, need go, we need we need uh, the driver's Google. license, graduation, Bams. We, Bams. We filed your taxes. Can I, can we need, we need which card do you want? I don't can see I any card that says Google. I, think, I just say congratulations. You filed your taxes. Bams. Bams, Bams, Bams. We gotta go to the gift. I think we gotta go to the gift cards over here. He said something. Google Play cards. That's that's, right. that's over that's by the right, gift George. cards, not the not these uh the not the birthday cards, Huns. What gift cards and birthday cards are different? Yeah, yeah. You know, you know when you give Whoopwick the 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 gift certificate to clown school. What were you saying something else, Weepy? Uh, that was just saying that he's right. You need to go to the gift card section where you will find that Google Play card. Oh, so not in the birthday card section? No. Uh, well, well, George is going to wheel me over to the cash register so we can pay for this. Uh, he, he wants his uh, dill hole chips that he's getting. He's, there's some kind of dill hole chips that he's going to be uh, getting because um, he, he likes the dill hole. So... Um, Grams, it's not the dill hole. We're gonna it's, go it's pay the, for that, the and then he'll he'll. It's the packy, the uh, one chip challenge. Uh, what? It's the one chip. Ch it's the the chips that you always get. The the chip, the one chip challenge. It's the ones that you always eat because you like the. Spice. Yeah, the dill hole chips. No, no, huh? It's the Doritos. Oh, the Doritos chips. That's right. I remember. All right. Well, let's go pay for this, and then then you can tell me. Uh, hopefully, you don't get diarrhea from eating this thing. I don't know. We'll see. I, I I'm excited to try it. I've been been looking all over for this, I and talk, I finally can found it. Can I talk him. to George for a second, Dorothy? Yeah. Hey, what's up? Hello. Can I talk? Hey, hey, George. Uh, it's kind of getting a little bit late here for me. So, would you did you find that Google Play card? Uh, Grams, you got the you got the Google Play card? No, I got the birthday no, card. It says you're one in a melon, and I, I told Oswepe that after we paid for your dill hole chip, uh, then we could go. He said I can't get a birthday card. I gotta go somewhere else. I think it's on the other side of the store. Ah, uh, yeah, because we, we gotta get the gift card, Grams. Right, that's where you will be able to find that Google Play card. So you're right, George. Uh, I don't understand, George. What do you want to do? Because I told you you got to pay for your dill hole chip before you eat it. You want to do that, or are we going over on the other side of the store to the gift? What What did you say they are? Gift cards? Uh, Grams, that's up to you. Yeah, we gotta get the gift cards, but we're also gonna get the, the, the one chip, and I got your Depends right here. I got all the quarks. I got everything, so we're, we're, we're good. We if just need the gift give cards, you son. a hard time about the butthole quarks, I want to make sure that it's an 8-gauge butthole cork instead of the 10-gauge. The 10-gauge were too small. Is uh, it 8-gauge this... butthole cork this time? Uh, yeah, let me take a look at the... Uh, yeah, 8-gauge. That's what it says. Oh, I mean, uh, ho well, hopefully well, they didn't the mess it up. and put eyeball put the... me. The eyeball me. I don't like them eyeball me. Let's go pay for your chip and then pay for the butthole corks and then we can go across to the other side of the store. Uh, we'll, we'll bring everything and put it in the car and then we'll go get Ozweepay 
uh, his his uh, a validation card, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, I, I, that's fine. That's fine. If we want to do that, we can. Whichever, it's easier for you. Okay. Well, that cash register way down there looks like it has uh, a, the smallest line. You should wheel me over there. Yeah. All right. Come on. Let's go over here, Grams. Thank you for shopping at Walmart. I love you. How can I help you? Oh, uh, yeah, we just want to have the, this stuff right here. Now, now the... You've got the, the Depends. Yep, the Depends. Hole corks. Yeah, now, this is the 8-gauge, correct? It's not chip. the 10-gauge, right? It says 8-gauge on the box, but last time we got the 8-gauge, and they had 10-gauge corks in there, so we want to make sure that it's the 8-gauge. Well, if you want to open it up and try one out, I can look the other way. All right, here, G Grams. Does this uh, does this look white? Yeah, yeah. Th this looks white to me, but I don't know. You gotta check. You know the feel yes, of them. That looks like the right size. That that looks like a, a much bigger than the ten gauge. The eight gauge is definitely um, would definitely fix my prolapse. No. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm this this seems. You Grams, this seems like the, this is gonna fit. So yeah, you, you don't want yeah you don't want something sm too small because then it's just gonna slide right out. All right, so we have uh, butthole corks, the pens, and the dill hole chip of destiny. And that comes to three hundred and twenty-two dollars and forty-seven cents, please. Okay. All right, here's your receipt and your change. Thank you for shopping at Walmart. I love you. Ah, uh, why? Thanks, Grams. He, he, here, take the Grams. Here, take the phone real quick so you can do this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this one chip challenge. Hello. Yes, Dorothy. Oh, Sweepe, I'm so glad to hear your voice. I thought you would never give me up, never let me down. Never turn around and, and hurt me. I'm so glad that you're still here for me. Oh. oh what were we talking about? Oh, yes, I was going to send you a... Um, I was going to send you a congratulations card. So first of all, you need to look for... A, you, need, you need to look for a Google Play card. Just look for a Google Play card first. To Google Play card. Well, I think that's on the other side of the store, and my grandson, George. So now, I really like eating all these dill hole spicy chips, and I think that's what's been giving me my diarrhea. So I'm going to let uh, George try one and see if he gets the diarrhea. And uh, I hope they don't mind that we opened, we, we paid for the, the dill hole chip. It's right there. And they can see our receipt, but the manager's like, he, boy, is he eyeballing George. You know, I don't know why when you come to Walmart, uh, they just, uh, they just, you know, they eyeball you and eyeball you. I've got my receipt here, and they've got this other uh, thing. So he's eating his dill hole chip right now. And uh, I'm going to wait. So now I think can I talk to, after I can eat I my talk chips, to him? it took about can I talk to 15 him for a minutes before I get the diarrhea. George, George, will you see if your stomach hurts after you eat your dill hole chip and get the diarrhea? He, he's, he says that um, he's symboling to me in sign language. Can I now, talk me, to him? Let me tell you about my grandson. Can this I is what I was him? talking can about I, being Can such I talk a to him parent. for a second? When I was younger, I taught him his own sign of wow. sign language. Me and him just Ooh. made it up. And you, you can't see what I'm doing right now, but I'm doing all sorts of sign language towards you. Can I talk you. to George for a and, second? Uh, you can't see oh my, my God, secret Gwams, sign that chip language is hot. I'm doing towards you right now, but only George can understand it. Oh, Gwams, that chip is hot. Hulk, how do you eat that? For a second? How do you eat that? 
Well, it's because I chain smoke a pack of unfiltered a day and I don't have any taste buds anymore. You know that. Oh, you're, you're looking a little bit uh, flush there, George. Oh, my God. I'm sweating like crazy right now, Grams. All right, so we'll end that right here. We still have more for this call coming up, so stay tuned for that. Make sure you're subscribed. Ring that bell for notifications so you'll be notified when the next parts come out, as well as any new videos and also when we go live because we live stream calling scammers all of the time. And we also live stream on Twitch, so make sure you're following us there. Links are in the description below. Please share this with family and friends, those who could be most vulnerable to falling victim to something like this so they know exactly how the scam is set up. So if they ever find themselves getting a call like this or on the call with an actual scammer, they'll know just to hang up and know that it's a scam and hopefully keep their hard earned money in their pockets and not going and getting gift cards. All right, smash that like button, sound off in the comments. And we'll see you in the next one.